Bananas in pyjamas are coming down the stairs. Bananas in pyjamas are coming down in pairs. Bananas in pyjamas are chasing teddy bears. Cause on Tuesdays they will try to catch them on the way. B1, that cloud looks like a banana. Oh, so it does, B2. B2? Down here, B1. Why are you lying down, B2? I tripped over that hole. A hole in the park. Look. Lots of little holes all over the park. I wonder how they got here, B2. It's a mystery. A mysterious mystery. Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B1? I think I am, B2. It's banana detectives time! Look for signs. Look for clues. Stay alert for any news. Be on guard. Ears to the ground. And listen hard for any sound. Banana detectives, banana detectives were on the trail, hot on the track. Banana detectives, banana detectives, whatever the mystery, it'll soon be history. Banana detectives, banana detectives, no case too hard to crack. Found any clues, Detective B1? Not yet, Detective B2. This is a difficult case, Detective B1. What we need is an eyewitness. Right! Uh, what's an eyewitness? Someone who saw what happened. Good idea! Let's find ourselves an eyewitness right away. Hmm, someone like... The Teddies! <laughs> Fine, thanks, Lulu. Why are you in such a hurry? We're the Detective Bananas, Lulu. And we're on a very important case. Oh, that sounds exciting. We found all these holes in the park. I've seen these holes too. You have? Do you know how they got there, Lulu? No, but I wondered if someone might have dug them to plant flowers in. But who would plant flowers in the park? Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B1? I think I am, B2. Topsy loves flowers! Let's go and ask her, Detective B2. <laughs> Good luck, Detective Bananas! Hello, Topsy! Bananas? Oh, watch out for the hole! <laughs> Are you OK? Bye, thanks. Why were you running so fast, Bananas? Because today we're the Detective Bananas, Topsy. And we're on a very important case. Really? What is it? The, the case of the mysterious, mysterious holes. Wow, that sounds exciting. See, Topsy, they're in the park. And we thought you might be digging them to plant flowers in. Me? Oh, I didn't dig them, Bananas. You, you didn't? didn't? But I've seen those holes too, Bananas. I thought somebody might be trying to find buried treasure. Ooh, but who would dig for buried treasure? Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B2? I think I am, B1. Rat in a hat. Let's go and ask him, Detective B2. <laughs> Good luck, Detective Bananas! Yeah. Ah, don't move, Bananas, or my beautiful card house will fall down. Oopsie. Sorry, Rat. Shh. We're the Detective Bananas, Rat. And we're trying to solve the case of the mysterious holes. See? Oh, yes. All those holes in the park. So you know about them, Rat? Of course I do. Ah. Shh. Did you dig the holes, Rat? Looking for buried treasure? I didn't dig them. You didn't? That means we still don't know where the holes came from, Detective B1. Oh. oh wait, Bananas. Every morning when I go for a walk, there's a new hole in the park. Every morning? 
which means somebody must be digging the holes at night. That's interesting, Detective B1. So I suggest that if you really want to catch this hole digger, you should keep watch on the park tonight. Good idea, Rat. The, the Detective Bananas are on the case. <laughs> Don't slap him! The door. Right, Detective B1. Our tent's up and looking good. Now let's check our equipment for tonight, Detective B2. Torch. Check. Binoculars. Check. Ah. What is it, Detective B2? There's a giant yellow thing staring at me, Detective B1. Look. Ah, you're right, Detective B2. It's huge. Do you think it's the mysterious hole digger? Wait a minute, B2. I think that huge yellow thing might be you. Look. Oh, and the thing I saw was you. <laughs> <laughs> Thank goodness. Now, we just have to wait for it to get dark. Nothing so far, Detective B2. Is that your watch ticking? I don't have a watch, Detective B2, so it must be yours. I don't have a watch either. Then what could be making that ticking noise? It's a mystery, Detective B1. Another mystery, Detective B2. Maybe we should stick to solving one mystery at a time, Detective B1. Good thinking, Detective B2. Oh, I hope the mystery hole digger gets here soon. It's past our bedtime. But we can't let ourselves fall asleep. Don't worry. I'm wide awake, Detective B2. And I'm wide awake too, Detective B2. <laughs> huh? What is it, B1? There's someone digging a hole, B2. Look. Oh. Quick, let's sneak up on them, Detective B2. No. I can't get out of my sleeping bag. Neither can I, Detective B1. We'll have to sneak up on them in our sleeping bags. Come on. Huh? Oh, what's that? The mystery hole digger is Pedro. I'm out of here. Wait, Pedro. We're just the bananas. See? Oh, you scared me, bananas. What are you doing out here? We're the detective bananas, Pedro. And we're after the mystery hole digger. I guess that's me. But why are you digging holes, Pedro? Well, bananas, I buried something special. Why did you bury it, Pedro? It was my special present, so I didn't want to lose it. So I buried it here in the park where it would be nice and safe. But now, I've forgotten where it is. That's a problem. I know. I only dig at night when no one can see me. Except for us. Right, Bananas. But I'm giving up now because I'm never going to find it. We know somebody who is sure to find your special present. Who? The, the Detective, Detective Bananas! Oh dear, we're never going to find it, Bananas. We've dug holes all over the park. Oh well, you did your best, Bananas. What was this special present, Pedro? It was a watch, Bananas. A really nice watch. Uh, anyway, thanks for trying. Didn't we hear a ticking sound last night? You're right, B2. So maybe the ticking sound was Pedro's watch. Come back, Pedro. We just need to dig one more hole. Look, there it is, Detective B1. Oh, bananas. Thank you. I never thought I'd see this again. But there's just one more thing. What's that, bananas? Now we've dug all those holes, we have to fill them in. Fill them in? <sighs> Phew! That's the last one, Detective B1. You helped me so much, I'd like to give you something. Give us what, Pedro? Here! My watch! But 
That's your special present, Pedro. I never would have found it if it wasn't for you. So, I'd really like you to have it. Oh, thanks, Pedro. But there's just one problem, Bananas. There's two of you and only one watch. So who's going to wear it? Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B1? I think I am, B2. It's Let's Wear a Watch time! It's a lovely day for a walk, B1. And here come the teddies. Hello, Hello bananas. bananas! Hello, teddies! <laughs> Why are you smiling so much, Bananas? Because Pedro gave us a present. Look! You're both wearing it at once. We're sharing it. Now we can tell the time together. <laughs> After you, B2. After you, B1. It's table tennis time. Huh? huh? Where did our balls go? Yeep. Found them. Good morning, bananas. Hello, rat. Look what I have for you. New table tennis balls. Thank you, Rat. Pajama Riffic. <coughs> we can't get the lids off, Rat. Just give them more muscle, Bananas. More, more muscle, muscle coming up. Maybe that was too much muscle. Could someone please help me up? We'll help you, Rat. Take hold of our hands. Oh. <sighs> Thank you, Bananas. Something's wrong. Oh, my hat! My hat is missing! Where's my hat? Oh, <laughs> there you are. Oh, what have I done? We'll help you, Rat. Oh. Gently now, Bananas, but not too much muscle. Oh! My hat! Oh, where did it go now? Oh no. Oh, I feel something. What is it, Rat? What do you feel? My poor hat. Oh, cheese and whiskers. You can fix it, Rat. Can't you? No, it's totally ruined. Oh dear. Oh, without a hat, I'm not Rat in the hat anymore. You've got to be Rat in the Hat. We'll get you a new hat. Right away. <laughs> What's wrong, Bananas? Rat in the Hat has broken his hat. And without a hat, he can't be a Rat in the Hat anymore. We have to find a new hat for Rat. Do you have any hats? We just have our own hats for wearing outside. But we do have those hats for playing dress up. I know where they are. <laughs> Rat's got to like one of these hats. Thanks, Morgan. We'll take them to him right now. We'll come with you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, once I was rat in the hat. Now I'm just rat with no hat. We've got hats. All for you, rat. Oh, thank you, bananas. But I don't think any other hat can replace my old hat. See how they look, Rat. You might like one of them. At least give them a try. What about this hat, Rat? Too big. This hat is nice. Much too small. This hat is the right size. Not too big and not too small. Oh, far too fruity. Now that's an interesting hat. But is it a hat for Rat? You should try it on, Rat. Very well, but this is the last one. Oh, oh it is interesting. Aye, aye, aye Captain, Captain Rat. Rat. <laughs> Captain Rat. Oh, that does sound rather good, doesn't it? Do you feel better now, Rat? Oh, yes. Though I feel much better. Oh, thank you, everyone. We did it. Rat's got a new hat. He's the rat in the hat again. So our sad friend is now our happy friend. Banana-tastic! Captain Rat! <laughs> I'm Captain Rat with a captain's hat. Arr. Good morning, Teddies. 
Hi, Hi bananas. bananas! Are you going to see Rat? We are. We hope he's still happy with his new hat. So do we. I spy some teddies off the port bow, and there blows a couple of bananas. Huh? Are you feeling all right, Rat? I've never felt better, me hearties. The sea is calling, and Captain Rat must answer. Arr! <laughs> I be planning a voyage to the far ends of the earth. I'll set a course to the Spanish main, then round the horn, then full sail to the Spice Isles. <laughs> Mateys. That sounds so exciting. Where are all those places? <laughs> no idea, me hearties. But that's what makes it exciting. You really want to go on a sea voyage, Rat? That I do, laddie. But a problem I have. Oh, now what is it? Do you have a boat? Ah! A boat! That be it! I need a boat! A boat? What about the old boat down at the beach? That'd be perfect, Captain Rat. Hi! The, the old, old boat! boat. Arr, this is just what a captain be looking for. But no one's used this old boat for ages. We've just played on it here at the beach. It'll be very dangerous to take out to sea. Ha <laughs> ha! Nonsense! A little bit of spit and polish and she'll be ship shape in no time. Arr! Now, a boat needs a crew. And I like the cut of your jib bananas. Thank you, Rat. I want you to set sail with me to see the world and explore the unknown. Ooh! And we might find treasure, too. Arr! <gasps> treasure! What say you then, me mateys? Are you ready for adventure? Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B2? I think I am, B1. It's adventure time! Look smart there. Patch that hole, me buckle. I want this ship to shine, me hearties. Aye, aye, Captain. Oh, they'll get into serious trouble with that old boat. It'll sink before they know it. How can we stop them? If only Rat hadn't put on that silly hat. I wish we hadn't have given it to him. And I wish we could take it back. We will. We'll get that hat and stop this now. Follow me, Teddies. <gasps> Some days when we see that small and sneaky fellow, he makes our banana skins lose their yellow. We sense he's up to something no good. We'd love to know what, if only we could. He is our dear friend, that rat in the hat. Even though he's naughty and greedy and that, makes us look for a trick that will out trick his trick. But we have to be slick, even quicker than quick, to pull out the mat from under the rat, that rat, rat, rat in the hat. What a fine looking boat she is! Aye! Oh, good work, me hearties! Thank, Thank you, you, Captain! All she needs now is a name. I'll be calling her the Cheese Nibble. Arr! If only it was like his old hat. That came off easily. Rat's old hat! That's what we need. Right, Teddies. Land number two. Uh, I don't. I think this will work. We have to try, Morgan. Let's get started. Scissors. Scissors. Needle. Needle. Thread. Thread. Patch. Patch. That's it. Are you sure? We've done it. It's as good as new. We've saved Rat's hat. <laughs> Bananas! Rat! Too late! Set a course for adventure, me hearties! <laughs> aye, 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 Captain! captain. <laughs> Hoist the mizzen mast, splice the main brace, all hands ahoy, baffle me barnacles! <laughs> aye! <laughs> They're heading for the rocks! I knew they wouldn't get far! Keep a steady course, me laddies! What about the rocks, Captain Rat? A rocks? A what rocks? Those rocks! Oh, those 
those rocks! All hands abandon ship! <laughs> rat! Where are you, Rat? Oh, cheese and whiskers. Is everyone okay? We're okay! But I'm not. Are you hurt? Have you swallowed some water? No! It's my wonderful ship, the Cheese Nibbler. Look at it. Oh, it'll never sail again. And my hat. I've lost another hat. We have your hat, Rat. Right here. Oh, dear. Another hat ruined. I'm back to being Rat with no hat again. But we have a hat for you, Rat. You do? One we know you'll really love. My old hat. And it looks just like you. Pajama Rivik! And it fits perfectly! Do you feel better now, Rat? <laughs> Wonderful! <laughs> I'm a rat, I'm a rat, I'm a happy, happy rat! <laughs> it's good to have our old rat back again. And do you know what? It's good to be back! Thank you, friends! to do today. Hmm. Have a nap, eat some lunch, have another nap. Oh, cheese and whiskers. So many things to do. Where do I begin? <sighs> Hello? Hello? Huh? Hello? Hello? I hear a hello, but I don't see anyone saying hello. What's going on? Hello? Hello? Who's making those echoes? Well, that's what I'd like to know. It sounded like... I'm B1! B1! I'm B2! B2! The Bananas! This is pyjama Riffic. 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 There they are! Bananas? What's the meaning of all the shouting? Shouting! 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 Oh, cheese and whiskers! 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 If you stand under here, Rat! 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 You can make great echoes, Teddies! 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 We can hear the echoes, Bananas! Everyone can hear them! They're very loud and very noisy! We're sorry! We didn't know. We didn't mean to upset everyone. From now on, we'll be as quiet as we can. <coughs> Something's wrong, B2. My throat is very sore. <coughs> so is mine, B1. And our voices sound all funny. Oh, dear. You'd better come straight home with us. Sip it slowly, Bananas. It's very hot. That hot lemon drink will help your sore throats. All that shouting made them sore. And made your voices go all squeaky. N no, no, Bananas. Don't talk. You've got to give your voices a rest. So no speaking till they're better. Uh, we don't understand, B1. Oh, you'd like more lemon drink? It's going to be hard for you not to talk, Bananas. But if you rest your throats, your voices will come back quickly. There might be another way for the Bananas to talk. You don't have to talk to talk. Huh? What do you mean? 
rain, Morgan. See those birds? They talk to each other, but they don't talk like us. Maybe the bananas could find a new way to talk. It looks like the bananas like your idea, Morgan. Let's just hope we like the idea too. in my list of things to do. I hardly started my first nap. <sighs> I'll just roll up my sleeves, hop to it, and get stuck in. Here I go. <sighs> bananas? Honking? Well, honking bananas? What are you doing, bananas? Yes, yes, I can hear the honks, but what are the honks for? Oh, there's something wrong with your throats. And you can't talk. So you're going to honk instead. But bananas, you can't be serious. Oh, cheese and whiskers, this will never do. Would you like one of my honey cakes, Camembert? Yes, please, Dolly. They do look delicious today. Uh, actually, they look delicious every day. Thank you. I'll have one myself. Look there, it's the bananas. Good morning, bananas. <gasps> well, I never. Thank you for helping me wash these windows, Topsy. My pleasure, Bernard. Hey, there's the bananas. Good, Good morning, morning, bananas. bananas. <laughs> oh, my. Bananas? They did what, Bernard? <laughs> they honked. We'll talk to the bananas about it right away. Hello? <coughs> really, Dolly? The banana startled you? <coughs> and you too, Camembert? Okay, we'll see the bananas as soon as we can. Understood. Thanks, Rat. Don't worry. We know all about it and we'll be talking to the bananas. Is this our fault? We did suggest that the bananas find a new way to talk. But I never thought it would be honking. Now, where are the bananas? Let's listen. I hear honking. Follow the honks. great time for a walk, but what you don't know is... But Bananas, we want to talk to you. The Bananas won't listen because they're too busy honking. Maybe they'd listen if we were honking too. That's it, Morgan. We'll talk to them with honks. 
But what can we honk? Let's see Bernard. He's sure to have something. You uh, want things that honk? So we can talk to the bananas in honks. Hmm. I think I have what you want in my storeroom. Uh, you see, I used to be in a marching band. Wow! Honk, honk. Honk, honk. We're the honking bananas today. Say hip hooray! We honk here, we honk there. In Cardlestown we're honking everywhere. Standing up, lying down, or sitting in a great big comfy chair. Honk honk, honk honk, we're the honking bananas today. Honk honk, honk honk, it's a new way to say hip hooray! Love the funny sounds we make Whenever we go walking It's better than a honey cake This great new way of talking You might not listen to us talking, Bananas. So we're going to honk. What do you think of this honk? And this is an even bigger honk. And here's a honk even bigger than that honk. And a honk all together? <laughs> Woohoo! What a honk! That was the biggest honk that's ever been honked! We can talk. And we don't sound squeaky. And our throats aren't sore. pajama -rific. It's like we said. You just had to rest your voices and you'd soon be better. Um, and the honking? Do you still want to honk? Now that we can talk, we don't have to honk anymore. <sighs> Everyone will be happy about that. And we won't make our throats sore again either. Because it's too hard to make big echoes with just us. Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B2? I think I am, B1. What if there were more people than just us? It's Echo Time! Ready? Ready, V1? Right, everyone. Get set for the biggest Cuddles Town Echo ever. And the very last Cuddles Town Echo ever. Right, Lulu. So let's make it good. Day, B2. A very beautiful day, B1. Hello, Pedro. Isn't it a great day? <sighs> what a big sigh, B2. A big sad sigh, B1. Is something wrong, Pedro? It's my mud. Your mud? What's wrong with it? It looks like the same old mud to us. Well, that's what's wrong with it. It's the same old mud. It's the same mud as yesterday and the day before that. And you know what it's going to be like tomorrow? Uh, no. Exactly the same as always. We know what you mean, Pedro. If you have the same thing every day, it can get a little boring. Like when we had green jelly for lunch every day. But then we changed to red jelly. And then yellow jelly. And now lunch is never boring. That's jelly, bananas. I'm talking mud here. Maybe what works for jelly can work for mud too. You should find some new mud, Pedro. New mud? Yes, there's lots of mud out there. All of it ready for you to roll about in. You just have to look. You're right, Bananas. It's new mud for me. Uh, 
Will you help me find some? Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B2? I think I am, B1. It's find mud for Pedro time! There's lots of mud here at the lake. And there's different types of mud too. There's some bubbly mud. There's some really thick mud. That's great mud for mud pies. <laughs> and there's very slippery mud. Huh. I want mud I've never seen. A special mud. The best mud in the whole world. We don't know anything about special mud, Pedro. We don't even know what the best mud in the world looks like. <gasps> I know what it looks like. It's here. This looks brilliant. Whee! <laughs> oh, you lovely mud. Pedro is here. But what about this rope around it? Maybe we're not supposed to touch this mud. This is the mud that dreams are made of. Ah. Pedro's a happy pig again. And we're happy that he's happy. Hello, Bananas. Hello, Teddies. Have we got a story to tell you? And it's all about mud. We have something to tell you first. About that cement down in the park. No one is to touch it until it dries. We're going to put a new swing on it. Cement? Isn't it that stuff you mix with water? And it looks like mud. Is something wrong, Bananas? Uh, if someone sat in the cement and it got hard... Would they get stuck? Mm, probably. Why? Oh, no! Pedro! Pedro! Get out of the mud as fast as you can! That mud isn't mud! What are you talking about, Bananas? This mud is the best mud I've ever rolled in! Just look at this! Huh? I can't roll. Can you move it all, Pedro? Try standing up. Oh, oh, I can't move. How can I get unstuck? Never fear, Pedro. Rat is here. Now, take hold of his arms, Bananas. Yes, yes rat. rat. Now, give him a good pull. The full heave ho. Full heave ho it is. One, two, heave ho, Bananas! Heave ho! Oh, stop, Bananas! Stop with the heave ho! It's no good. <laughs> with lots of soap! Soap? Ugh. It'll be okay, Pedro. It'll be like taking a bath. A bath? Ew! We need buckets. All the buckets we have. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like soap. I like muddy. Hmm, I think we've soaped you up enough, Pedro. You won't get any more slippery than this. Try and pull Pedro out again, Bananas. <laughs> I think there could be a problem here. Set? What problem, Charlie? Heave ho! <laughs> That problem. Oh, cheese and whiskers. Sorry, Rat. Pedro is now too slippery to grab hold of. What else can we try? We could crack the cement around Pedro with a great big hammer. A hammer? Oh. Maybe we need something gentler, Charlie. <laughs> you could be right, Amy. Yes. Extraordinary. <laughs> Fascinating. <laughs> Shh. Charlie's thinking. <laughs> I think I have it. We'll free Pedro with bouncing. Bouncing? Bouncing. Come with me, Bananas. I need your help. We're right behind you, Charlie. <laughs> they should be here somewhere. Aha. Uh -huh. Here we are. <laughs> My electric pogo sticks. 
I call them bounce bots Banana tastic! If we bounce around Pedro with the bouncer bots, the force will gently push him up, like a cork coming out of a bottle, and Pedro will be free. What a terrific idea, Charlie! It might just work. Will it be safe? It should be very safe. Absolutely safe. Trust me, I'm a rat. But just in case. Ready when you are? Get the bouncer bots ready, bananas! Ready! <laughs> Start, bouncer bots! Now! Here we go! Hi! Oh, look at me! <gasps> it's working! Pedro's coming out! Whoa. And I've landed in some mud! Should they be going that fast, Charlie? No, they shouldn't. Bananas, you must press the emergency stop button. It's the blue button. But don't press the red button. Got it, Charlie! Press the red button! <laughs> no, no! <laughs> Far out. <gasps> Will they be okay? Not to worry. I did plan for something like this. I don't like the look of this, B2. What bounces up must also bounce down, B1. We've got parachutes. Whee this is fantastic mud. Maybe the best mud ever. Hello, Pedro! It's great to see you out of that cement. Oh, thanks to you, bananas. Is, is everyone okay? We're pajama rific What about you, Pedro? Great! Look at this mud. It's the perfect mud I've been looking for. It's brilliant. But Pedro, don't you know where you are? It's my home. The perfect mud was here all the time. There's no mud like home mud. Bananas, you're right. Yay! Yeah!